All right. Well, it, it, uh, it's good to chat with you here. And, you know, I, I think it, it's amazing to see what, what some celebrities are doing in terms of, of stepping up uh, during this really challenging time. I, I want to start with this story. I, I saw it first thing this morning. Michael Che from SNL. What he is doing uh, for folks in New York City is tremendous. It is even beyond tremendous. I mean, you know, his grandmother died not too long ago, uh, days ago from coronavirus, and he was really just heartsick over it. And the idea that he has given, you know, he's paying the rent for more than a thousand people uh, in low income housing in New York City. Well, he still is going through this. And, you know, Alex, what you got to remember too is, you know, there are gazillionaires like, you know, Jeff Bezos. And it's fantastic what Jeff Bezos is doing, mm -hmm. you know, giving billions of dollars. But there are other people who really are pushing themselves. You know, uh, Michael Che does very well, but he's not Jeff Bezos. And yeah, the idea that he's stepping up and doing this is really phenomenal. It really is. And I think uh, it sounds to me like Michael is also trying to raise some broader issues here. Because uh, I, I know one of the things he's talking about is, look, there should be debt forgiveness, especially when you're talking about uh, folks in the middle of a crisis who, who already live in public housing. Yeah, and it's true. And it's complicated. Because, you know, you talk about debt forgiveness, and it rolls downhill. And so remember that depending on who the person either works for or lives at, where they live, um, there is somebody who owns that apartment building, there is somebody who has a small business, and you know, if, if they don't get their money and they go under, then what happens to the people who are living there, who are working there? So it's very complicated, sure. but he is certainly doing his part here. Yeah, trying to raise awareness. Okay, uh, down your way in, in L.A., I mean, uh, we've, I think we've talked a few times about uh, actor Danny Trejo. I mean, we know that he is, is a, a very generous person uh, in so many ways for, for his community. Uh, and now, of course, during this crisis, he is stepping up for healthcare workers. Yeah, and, and look, I, I know Danny Trejo. I've known him for a long time, and I love this guy. He is, he is amazing. And his, his life is amazing, but Danny is so charitable and always like wants to do good and, and doesn't like seek out publicity for it. He just does it. And he is dishing out. He has, Alex, he has an amazing restaurant in LA, or actually he has like three or four of them, but there are these taco places, or Trejo's Tacos, and they're delicious. And he is uh, serving up thousands of meals for healthcare workers and delicious meals uh, all over the city. And, you know, and there are a lot of Danny Trejos out there. There are a lot of people who are doing really good things and are doing it not for publicity, but they're doing it because they want to help. Right. And, you know, we haven't seen anything quite like this in, in my lifetime where so many people are stepping up. Yeah, and it, it's just really, yeah, good. it just kind of warms your heart in some ways to see so many people, um, you know, just doing nice things for others uh, who, who really need the help right now. Uh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, well, you want to make another and, point? And Alex, yeah. yeah, I do. I really do. That, you know, we are in the middle of a tragedy here. I mean, with thousands of people, tens of thousands of people dying. That doesn't mean that at the time we mourn and at the time we deal we can also celebrate what, what people are doing here. It's just unlike anything I've ever seen. Remember, Alex, because it wasn't that long ago, it was a month and a half ago, how divisive the society was. And people have really come together in a big way over the last month or so. And it's really heartwarming. Yeah, it, it is. It is amazing what what you see happen in terms of that uh, during a crisis like this, a national crisis. Um, all right, Harvey. Well, it is a it's a pleasure. It's good to connect with you here virtually. So I get, we're going to be doing this on a regular basis now. So I'm excited about that. We were missing we the, are, uh, the FaceTime with you. All right, we buddy. I know, I know you're busy. Uh, take care. We'll talk to you soon. Okay, Alex. We'll see you. All right. All right. Be Bye. well. Thanks.